Stop by to interact with the community and I every Friday night at 8 o'clock for live stream Fridays. Welcome trolls. <laughs>
red, dark, thick light inside of that little circle here, the dial. So digital cameras and even cell phone cameras are far more sensitive than our eyes. Our eyes are only able to see between longer and shorter wavelengths. So now let's go to the moon, guys. Recent footage that I got on February, uh, uh, am I gonna say it? February 11th, uh, 2019. Yeah, big snowstorm here. So we got a lot of footage and a lot of things that we can look through until that beautiful weather comes back again. The moon's out, say to yourself that, right? So the minute the storm clears up, watch the clear skies. The structuring is right there, all lined up side by side, massive, and lines are connected to these things, whether they're connectors or not. I don't know, but I can see them, and they're appearing like crazy. Um, there's, at times, nine to 10 objects side by side. Look carefully, they look like little speed bumps, you know, little chicken pox on the moon if you want. They're all lined side by side right there, and they're all over the surface, scattered everywhere. The construction that is going on on the surface is that white material that you're seeing. All those lines, those bumps, the symmetry on the surface. That's what's hard to clarify. Again, they have the same reflectivity as the surface. People have a hard time distinguishing them. 